Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to share with you my uh, journal lineup for the new year. I have a couple of traveler's notebooks here as well as some um, miscellaneous uh, notebooks slash um, covers that I, that I will be using for this year. I'll start with the passports first. So here I just have this dashboard. I have some pictures of Doyang, and I think that this is just an extra one that I have and some stickers from <clears throat> Tokyo Pen Shop from my uh, previous order. And then I also have this file folder that I made myself out of um, AT's second mini album. And here I just have my monthly. Right now it only has um, everything logged in from the fall semester at uni. So that's uh, it's the blank monthly by the Traveler's Company. And I don't have anything in, in here either. I have the clear folder where I just keep the extra um, writing boards uh, because I'm not currently using this. Um, journal right now because I'm not in, really in school and this is my weekly where I just kind of log everything in that I do at uni this helps me um, keep track of all my assignments and everything uh, I will not continue to be using the Jibun Techo because the writing is very limited or no the space is very limited and I write a lot <laughs> So um, I figured if I didn't really use it last uh, last year, I shouldn't repurchase it because it's quite expensive to get here. And here, I just have um, a couple of pictures that really don't go with this journal, but at the time I just needed somewhere to put them. Uh, this is my newest addition to my uh, Traveler's Company or Traveler's Notebook family. Uh, the little journal's name is Taika. I got him during the summer and um, it's been keeping me up to date with all of my um, schoolwork and I will continue to use these same um, two blank in inserts because th since they are blank I can just kind of rearrange it for this year because um, I do think it has like ha over half of it empty so I'll be saving some money there and it's really it's a really um, easy format for me to follow because I used to do um, bullet journaling before this and kind of had the same setup as the um, as the weekly uh, in, week, weekly inserts so I'll just continue to do that for now until I find um, something better uh, that's it for planners really um, I am trying to get a hold of either AT's or EXO's seasons greetings because I do want to display those somewhere in my room as well as use the um, diary that they come with. So that's Little Taika. And then we have Little Bentley, my first passport. <laughs> Little Bentley is very, very, very dear to me. Here I have the um, Traveler's Notebook um, folder. It has this sticker that um, Anna sent to me uh, sometime last year or not the beginning of this year yeah during the spring sem spring semester I um, actually I think I did a, jur a journal with me of this happy mail and you can see when I uh, when I put that sticker there here I just have some miscellaneous um, stickers that I actually didn't even know I had in here <laughs> so I'll definitely be using these <coughs> more often now that I know uh, here is the other um, AT's folder that I made when I decided to pull apart my EP2 album. Uh, it just has a, a thank you card with picture of Hobie from BTS. Uh, I made this little um, booklet when I was going to travel during the summer so it just has all the leftover um, stickers. These are all 
majority of these are stickers because it's sticker paper and then this the washi portion of it as well and here's more um, the <laughs> photo card of Wompin <laughs> I don't know the reason for having two folders other than I just have too many folders and kind of want to display them at the same time <laughs> you have another writing board a little um, uh, what, what are these called? Note, note cards from Paper Hands. And, um, oh, I have Volume 5 in here right now, but usually what's in here is my uh, Mingi notebook. My Mingi journal. I don't know where that's at at the moment, because I did take some pictures when I was doing Bentley's one year anniversary on my Instagram. So... Yeah, volume 5 is here for now. And that's it for the passports. I do have these little charms. I got this one at um, Michael's. And then this one came with uh, a Mingi uh, charm that I bought. But it came slightly um, defective. So I pulled it apart and just put it here. because it, it still comes... It, it was from the Mingi charm. So it's on my in my Mingi journal. And yeah. So, okay. this is the third um, Traveler's Notebook that I own. Here I have a charm from ours, and then these two little ones are from Michael's. It came with in the same pack of as the previous charm. Right now, this has my volume 14 as I am trying to catch up on my daily journaling. I have everything written down. I just need to kind of finish uh, a couple of spreads in here before I can file this with my other journals. I made this dashboard of Mingi when he was on a little hiatus and because this uh, notebook I used it during um, the time that he was away I kind of wanted to uh, have uh, his picture here at all times. Oh by the way this is, I did mention that this is my third traveler's notebook that I own and I, I named it Sonhua because it's black and black hair Sonhua is just superior to everything else okay and I have this uh, folder this was also from the this was actually from the Michaels um, traveler's notebook that they own that they carry it was the first um, folder that I that I had so I kind of pulled it apart here and there and I just haven't gotten around to kind of um, styling it again and here I have one of those um, three-fold files, which, which I purchased two of these because I have two uh, I have two regular um, traveler's notebooks, but I actually don't use them at all. So I kind of I need to find a better use for them. Right now, they just store like extra washi tapes, uh, extra washi tape um, strips here that I can use later on. And right now it has my volume 14 as I mentioned. Um, slowly uh, getting to finish it. Uh, usually I use one traveler's notebook and the other stays as my collab insert uh, notebook which I'm gonna try to get back into collabs in during the new year. We'll see how that turns out. And um, previously here I had a lot of paper hands uh, stickers that I just use daily um, but I am working on finding other ways to kind of store all my stickers so it's easier for me to uh, uh, use them and just more for them to be more accessible for me so that way I have like a bigger variety of stickers I can use. I retired Sonhua. I used uh, I was using it during volume 14, but now as I moved into volume 15, I've moved back to my very first traveler's notebook. I received this on my birthday uh, last year, as in 2018, so it's been a little over a year with this little one. Uh, well, I named her Saoirse, as, as in Saoirse Ronan. She's one of my favorite art, uh, actresses. And I just, I love her so much that I named my notebook that. Here, 
I have volume uh, 15 and it's already quite chunky and <laughs> I think I'm barely like in the first uh, like mid second week of use so here I just have a couple of classic -y, um, le uh, what are they, what is it called letterpress and also Chen's um, April in a flower the the first um, his first mini album I just think it looks really lovely there can you is, can you see that there's okay and I have a couple of Polaroids and photo cards that I received um, and stickers I received these stickers from Martha in a Happy Mail and I printed out this uh, Polaroid of Toyon myself and then I received this photo card from up um, Zello at a BAP concert that I went to in 2018 yes or 19 no it was 2018 and this is my updated um, file folder cover it's really all over the place I just wanted to kind of put a lot of the stickers that I really like here just kind of to remind me of the things that I like, the color schemes that I like here I just have a lot of miscellaneous uh, Traveler's Company uh, stickers as well as La Dolce Vita and um, Paper Hands before she rebranded and uh, she gifted these to me actually and as well we have another one of these booklets here and another threefold that I also keep a lot of washi tapes on on handy and I just have some papers right here and a, a Mingi a Polaroid I actually exchanged this if there used to be a Jaehyun Polaroid here but I I changed it just to have a little bit of variety and this is the back I don't really like how this looks I don't think this is very me per se but um I love the art so much so it's okay and I received this other folder from Hannah photo card that I received from my best friend on my birthday so I just keep these here they used to be at on the cover but I switched it out and then this is my current um, my current insert I am decorating as I go along so I have here poetic beauties a classic -y, um, note note card I just kind of um, recycle a lot of um, outlines of, of stickers uh, P palette stickers that I received paper hands and this uh, insert itself I received from Hannah she sent me a little birthday gift and uh, it was included in there and um, these spreads I think you've by now you've already seen them if not most of them I'm still working on catching up and just kind of uh, not overwhelming myself by trying to journal every day but I do like to journal every day to just kind of keep track of um, how I'm feeling, what I'm doing in the moment, just kind of keep my memories intact. Uh, I made this little, um, what is this called, film strip with uh, screen screenshots of the Obsession music video and it's just a lot of sound. <laughs> because he's wrecking me again and this lovely um, bookmark that I use in my um, in my spreads uh, I received from Lorna as a birthday gift as well I don't think I have anything no, I don't have anything else. here I have some sticker uh, sheets from Softly Studio which I actually need to put these away somewhere else but I'll keep them here for now 
So here I have a lot of um, printables from Alice from Hello Alice and M from Juni. I want to say I never I can never pronounce her usernames, but they are so creative and so cute. So I have those here, and then I also cut out the Poetic Beauty um, Jaehyun sheet that I received from Rosie. So I just have those there, and just a lot of miscellaneous sticker sheets that I actually don't really use at all. Um, might have to file these somewhere else. So these are my journals for the upcoming year. A little recap before I go into like the more miscellaneous. It's just, it's actually just two of them. Um, this is my current uh, daily journaling insert. Uh, this is my collab insert, which I need to get back on collabs very soon. This is my Mingi insert, which I just journal to and about Mingi. It's kind of cheesy, but it helps me kind of have someone to talk to when I don't really want to go on full disclosure with anyone else. I just kind of want to talk to myself more in depth than I would in my daily journal. And then here I have my daily planner. Now for miscellaneous, this was going to be my, I think this is backwards, not that. This was going to be my um, K-pop journal. But as I found, I don't have a lot of time to dedicate a whole journal to K-pop. So I do it in my day, I do it in my daily journal where I just kind of, um, recap comebacks that really interest me or from my olds so I, d I quickly decided to just make this into like a um, daily notepad but one that doesn't come out easily so here I just have um, a lot of different <laughs> miscellaneous um, writing about anything and everything and then um, yeah, I just use it as such and I have a couple of things here at the back that were supposed to be for my K-pop journal as well as this um, Polaroid of Lucas from Wavy slash NCT. And um, lastly, I have this little, it's so cute, this little um, passport, uh, I, well it is a like kind of like a notebook, but I use it more as what it's intended to, which is just to store ephemera. Oh, it's all over the place right now. I just had a little journaling session. But I received this from Sophie. She has a shop and uh, I was, I've was i tried for the longest time since she came out with the first set of um, journals to get my hands on either the white ones or the light grayish ones because those are kind of more in what I, colors that I'm into but they always sell out so quickly so I made sure to get this one because the passport is just so cute so I would definitely recommend it when she does come out with more to get one because you get a lot of different um, paper styles and colors and you also get um, more ephemera in the back with larger pieces it's just honestly it's a very um it's, it's a very nice way to store ephemera that you know you're gonna use and just have it very accessible to you um, right away I like to keep this on my desk at all times so that if I don't really know what to use or if I have uh, something that I want to use I can totally just grab grab it really quickly so that is my journal lineup I'm sorry if it seemed a bit rushed I've been trying to film this video so many times now but I just I need to get a better tripod because I kind of want to do over over uh, hang la layouts but the tripod that I have right now only lets me film at this angle <laughs> So I feel like I had more things that I wanted to talk about. Um, do let me know if you'd like me to elaborate on something down in the comments. And um, I would also 
be very interested to, to know your um, lineups if you have a video I'm most like and if I follow you I'm most likely you already saw it but um I am very interested to know uh, what journals you're gonna use and uh, I guess what I want to say it's what is your preferred style of planning because uh, I know a lot of people are, e are either using the Hobonichi or the Jibun Techo or the standard travelers company um, inserts so oh and also a lot of people use bullet journals so um, I'm kind of I'm kind of interested to know kind of how you planned or if you plan because I know um, some people don't plan or don't use planners to uh, go about their days and I I, that I cannot <laughs> I need to plan things out or else I or I need to write things down or else I don't get them done so um, thank you so much for watching. Uh, I uh, I will see you next time. Uh, hopefully, very very soon. I'm trying to set a goal for myself to post more often and um, to kind of be more involved with you guys. So thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time. Bye.